Now we come from a broad range of backgrounds and experience as I look around the room, but the uniting feature that we have is that we all want to be bold for change, the theme of this year's International Women's Day. It's also about declaring the bold actions that you'll take as either an individual or an organisation to progress gender imbalance. And really that's the aim of our gathering, thinking about the ways that we can address both the structural and the personal barriers that result in only 11% um, of our profession being women. And to create opportunities both for us, for others, and I guess for our employers and organisations as well. Here today, I think it is really impressive if we come from different companies, we come from government, we come from academia in a broad range of job roles, be that as uh, researchers, be that as teachers, forensic analysts, we have policy makers, we have uh, political staffers, CIOs, CISOs, business accelerators, so such a broad range. Um, of different job roles. We all have, I think, different um, levels of positional power within our organisations, and I think it's incumbent on all of us uh, to use that where we have that. But we also all have the power of influence and we have the power of leadership. That's something that I'd like you to reflect on today about how we individually can use that power that we have. We're looking for your ideas about how we can make that bold change and the practical actions that we can take. What I'd encourage you to do is uh, just two really simple things. One is to tell a story and the other is to open a door. And the open the door is something that anyone can do, male or female, and it's to give a woman an opportunity to do something that she doesn't think that she's ready for.